Hey everyone, welcome back to the Crypto ZX channel. You guys know what time it is. We're going to be talking about none other than Sui Coin. So if you enjoy these Sui updates, do smash that like button as it does go a long way. So as we are going into Wednesday morning, you are seeing the market starting to go back into the green. But if you're looking at Sui, it is down about 1.4%, seeing a little bit of a minor pullback. And again, when we pull out the charts, things will make more sense. So if you enjoy these updates, you guys know what to do. The price is trending at $1.96, down about 1.8% in both Bitcoin and USD comparative. Market cap is at about $5.4 billion, and the 24-hour trading volume is at about $1.35 billion. Obviously, we're seeing a little bit of a retracement. It's no secret, but when I pull out the charts, like I said, you know, we can kind of talk about um, you know, what's really happening. And, you know, when visuals are in, involved, you can really understand a little bit better. But before I get into it, as always, just a quick disclaimer. Anything on this channel is not financial advice. Always do your own due diligence and research when you are investing in crypto. So looking at the dominance index, it's picking up traction going into Wednesday morning, but nothing too crazy, but still on the verge of breaking towards a new yearly high. And we cannot forget about this. Looking at Bitcoin, on the other hand, going into Wednesday morning, you're starting to see something very interesting playing out. So um, obviously we know about that WIC at $64,566 Sunday. And obviously we, this, we're going into Wednesday morning and we're yet to see that WIC being filled. And what a WIC being filled means is pretty much in the price heading back to that WIC's level, which obviously we haven't seen happen. We did see the price of Bitcoin going up to that 63.3 range, but um, never really managed to cross back above $64,000. And again, I'm sure people are starting to realize how important that specific 64K level really is because I've been emphasizing it quite a bit on this channel because that is a confirmation that I've set for myself pretty much since back on August 5th wake, whether it's um, July 4th, that is a very, very important level. But still, we're sitting at 62,200, which is not bad to see. But let's take a closer look and see what is happening with Sui's price. And again, this right here is the daily time frame. And you know, the daily time frame shows us everything. You know, it kind of shows us, you know, the price uh, pattern for Sui, what has happened over the course of the last year, year and a half, um, and you know, where it's currently sitting at. And you can pretty much see this for yourself. You know, Sui had that initial run, um, you know, leading up to that new all time high back in March of this year. And exactly, literally exactly as we predicted on this channel uh, that, you know, there is going to be a little bit of, you know, a hurdle that is going to come in its way when we retest the all time high. So I did say we might see choppy levels. That's exactly what ended up happening. You can see we actually did break out and, you know, towards the all time high and we actually got rejected as soon as we retested it. And again, if you were to ask me, this does not come as a surprise to me at all. And something like I said, I've been emphasizing on my SUI updates over the course of the last few days. Profit taking happens, you know, whale manipulation is obviously a key. And, um, you know, that's exactly what's happening right now. But again, if you want to put this into perspective, SUI is down 10%. You've heard that correct. After retesting its all time high, for the first time since March, SUI has seen a retracement of 10 cents. I'm sorry, not 10 cents, 10%. Now, what you're also noticing right now is where are we currently, um, you know, sitting in terms of the Sui's price? It's currently at a dollar ninety-five, and a dollar ninety-five at one point was none other than its all-time high. You can see this for yourself. Back in Feb, that was its all-time high. We saw a pullback down to the dollar twenty-one, and then you know, market picked up traction again, and you know, Sui made its way up to two dollars and eighteen cents. You can pretty much see something very similar playing out right now. Obviously, we did see that initial uh, retest to the all-time high, which itself is a massive, massive deal, which a lot of people uh, continue to forget. That is a massive deal. The fact that, you know, we were able to actually reach an all-time high. Uh, but, um, you know, remember what happens when all-time highs are retested. You do tend to see profit-taking occurring, and that is a normal thing, and we cannot forget about that. So um, what happens if, um, you know, we don't, stay at the support obviously you know a little bit of more downside could be in play maybe the next support um you know of a dollar 80 could be retested and again if you want to put that into perspective that would be a move of an additional about eight percent a sharp drop of course with the momentum that we're currently seeing obviously it would be a surprise but you know let's not forget and again i want to give you guys a continuous reminder literally over the last one month alone sui is up 140 percent so you know, people tend to forget that, but you on the Crypto ZX channel don't want to be forgetting these things. But so far, so good. Exactly what it's doing. And I do project an all-time high will eventually come, especially if Bitcoin turns things around. I don't know what this is. I thought I paid for this. But anyhow, you know, 
as things turn around, I do believe we are going to see, uh, you know, Sui really playing with that momentum as we have seen in the past. But st I have some stop losses in place, especially, you know, the people that picked it up early on. Um, you know, obviously locking in profits is very important. And if obviously if you're mega bullish, you know, you're going to see Sui breaking out towards a new all-time high. Um, then, you know, obviously having stop losses in place just kind of, um, you know, gives you a little bit of a protection in terms of if the prices were to go down. So, you know, your profits are locked rather than kind of getting wiped out. And I'm sure no one wants to see that. And speaking about profits, you know, if you're looking at your portfolio, whether it's Sui or any other coin that has been pumping, you know, quite a bit, then, you know, if you're asking yourself that's too much money that you cannot afford to lose, well, guess what? That's the biggest hint that it's for you to lock some profits in. Don't listen to the trolls on the internet stating that, you know, no, you know, you're crazy to lock in profits. Absolutely not. It's always smart to lock in profits. Profit is profit at the end of the day. But yeah, let me know down below what you guys think. What are your personal projections? Love each and every one of you guys. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for all your support. And with that said, I'll wrap it up here. We'll see you tomorrow. Been Crypto ZX and peace out.